Now, if you've not already watched my move-in day vlog from my first day at Loughborough, then go check that out. But today is day two of Freshers. So for day two, first up, I went to the gym this morning for the first time. I'm over at Hollywell Gym. Honestly, the facilities are incredible. I was pretty like, amazed by how insane the facilities are. Next up, what happened? We went down into town. So we checked out Loughborough Town Committee, went and guided us around. And that was quite a good insight just to kind of know where things were. And then for the remainder of the day, we've just come back in. We had some bit of a meal earlier on. And then pretty much this evening, I think we're meant to be going to one of the clubs in town called Firefly. As always, I'll document that along the way and uh, I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. Okay, so today is day three. Pretty much what we've done so far today is this morning, we had a chance to catch up with the committee. So they did like a meet the committee session. And I'll be honest, a little bit before then, I was a bit still uncertain about a few things. So to be able to ask those guys a couple of questions was really nice and I feel a bit more settled in already. Then we had a quick campus tour just after that. They obviously grabbed lunch like usual. And then after that, I had a quick game of football with some of the guys in our block. And then pretty much for the rest of the day, this evening we're over at the Union again for another welcome party. If you can't tell slightly by my voice, I managed to get a slight bit of Freshers Flu. I didn't think Freshers Flu was gonna be like this, I'll be honest, but um, yeah, I definitely would say prepare yourself before coming to uni. Um, I've been taking tablets and stuff all day. Um, yeah, pretty much plans for today because I'm a bit limited. I can't really do too much apart from being in bed. I had a chat with some of the others because a lot of my other housemates have got fresh flu as well. But um, yeah, today's a bit of a boring one, unfortunately. But uh, I'll catch up with you tomorrow and hopefully I'm feeling a bit better by then. Not much really happened yesterday. I'm starting to feel a bit better, I'll be honest, um, which is always good and encouraging to see because I know some people have said that fresh flu can last two to three weeks. At least I think it's fresh flu because I've tested for COVID. It's not COVID still. Um, but yeah, in terms of plans for today, so we were supposed to have something called Royce 100, which is where you run 100 laps around Royce, but unfortunately it's had to be canceled today because of the weather. So I think for the rest of the day, it's gonna be largely resting up a little bit. I'm gonna catch up with my family because I haven't really had too much time to speak to them. And I'll be honest, I'm starting to miss home a little bit at times and um, just get myself more familiar with the campus, the facilities, and uh, get my head around a few things. So today's another day and luckily I'm feeling so much better than I have been for the last few days. As I mentioned yesterday, Royce 100 was supposed to happen yesterday. That's got cancelled because of the rain. So that's happening today instead. And what that involves is running 19 miles, so 100 laps around Royce. And then after that, so that should be around, I think 11 o'clock we've been told to head down there for. And then after that, I think we've got high tables afterwards in the dining hall, a massive celebration afterwards. And then from there, we'll be heading over to Project. What I've been up to today so far, was this morning we had some games in the common room. Then this afternoon I did a bit of UV dodgeball. So that was over in the Hollywell gym over among the sports halls in there. That was actually really enjoyable because I've never done UV dodgeball or anything like it before. Now is the evening, so just about to get ready to head out for dinner with again with the rest of the flatmates who again, I've been spending so much time with this week as well as guys from other blocks. But in particular, we as a block and we as a flat, we've actually been getting on really, really well. And um, because I remember for me personally, Ahead of coming to university, making friends was something I was a bit apprehensive about. But um, definitely, my advice for you guys, any of you like watching, is that it's really easy to make friends and just put yourself out there and don't be afraid. Because especially if you're coming to Loughborough or if you're going to any other university for that fact, but especially Loughborough here, everyone seems really, really kind and accepting. And uh, everyone I've spoken to has just been nothing but honestly just amazing. But um, yeah, I think then the plan for tonight as well is we're going to another one of the clubs in town called Echoes. So yeah. If I don't see you guys the rest of the day, I'll catch up with you again tomorrow. So today's my first weekend at university. Uh, the first week so far has actually been going really, really well. I've actually been loving my time here. It's the first day actually today that we're not getting food provided. So I'm in a catered hall where we're given three meals a week. Sorry, not three meals a week. Three meals a day, five days a week. Um, and yeah, it's actually been really nice, the food. I've been quite surprised because I'll be honest, my standards weren't too high. I didn't want to go in expecting it to be gourmet because I, I knew that wouldn't be that the case, but it's actually been a lot better than I expected. Um, but yeah, today's first time cooking for ourselves. Uh, plan for today is we've got a sports bazaar meant to be showing all different sports we can get involved with and signing up for trials. So I'll definitely be signing up to some of those. And then this evening, I think it's another night out at the Union. So I'll catch up with you guys. And I'll show you some of that along the way. So like I said, yesterday was the Sports Bazaar. Today, I've got the Societies Bazaar. So again, that's over in Sir David Wallace. And what that's meant to be is showcasing all of the societies this time. So yesterday was all the sports. Today's all the societies. And there's meant to actually be over 100 societies, I've been told. So that should be quite interesting. And that will probably take up most of the day. Then after that, 
uh, I think me and a couple of the lads we've got planned uh, to have a little football session so I think we're gonna do like a little six side tournament and then I've actually got my lectures starting tomorrow so I'll probably start planning for those so having a little look through making sure I kind of know where I'm going where the buildings are and uh, getting prepared for that so today's Monday I've just come back from my first set of lectures it's definitely a lot different to sick form for sure like the whole style of learning it's something I've definitely not used to before but at the same time, I'm really excited as well as realizing that, okay, this is quite a big step up. So this morning, basically there were like introductions to our modules and stuff. So basically like the chance to meet the lecturers, be introduced to like really basic content. And the main thing we were kind of assigned was things like reading lists. So they gave us like a bunch of books to look at and read. So I've got to go to the library again. I've only dropped in there once before actually so far, just on the campus tour. So I need to go and head over there some time. Um, and scanning some books and just go and read ahead of my lecture section. In terms of plans for the rest of the day, so this evening we are back on, we've got a, a set of punch parties I believe. Pretty much that's the plan, I'll document some more along the way as we go in, catch up with you guys tomorrow. So today's Tuesday, pretty much plan for today is I've got another two lectures today throughout the day, then I finish by 4pm. So 4pm onwards I'm going to work on my application to become a student ambassador as I found out about this a few weeks back. I've been working on it across the summer and honestly it'll be a privilege to become a student ambassador for the university and then this evening we've actually got a day off so we've not got any nighttime activity so I think a few of us might be having a chilled one we might go to the common room and uh, just have a chilled se session down there maybe play a bit of pool a bit of table tennis and uh, just get to meet some new people probably today's so far summary I had a lecture first up this morning then in the afternoon we don't have lectures in the afternoons because we compete in bucks so it's basically where everyone who plays for the university in sport they will have their fixtures on a Wednesday afternoon, so nobody has any lectures. So instead, I've actually had two trials. So I had a trial first up for AU football, which I think went okay. And then I had my trial for AU futsal, and I got news of being invited back to callback. So that's really exciting to hear that. Um, pretty much after that, we just had grabbed dinner a second ago. And now we've just been getting ready for a night out at the Union. Just about to go and head out to that. And then I'll catch up with you guys most likely tomorrow. So as I said yesterday, we had Hey You last night which was actually really good fun because not only did I get a chance to see some of my friends from Royce, but also actually from other halls as well because I bumped into quite a few of my course mates who I've kind of got on with really well already. Plans for today. So first up this morning, I've actually just been recapping some of the stuff I've been going through this week in my lectures. Then actually this afternoon, I've got my callback for AU Futsal. So I'm really looking forward to that and hopefully I can get in as that would honestly be amazing. And then this evening, I'll probably just go back over again some more stuff from the rest of the week. Just make sure I'm on top of things. Um, might check out some of the other facilities so I need to double check in some stuff at the library because I've got my head around most things but I just want to ask one or two questions in particular to the academic librarian but um, yeah that's pretty much the plans for today. Finally today is the final day of Freshers. It's certainly been an amazing experience, it's been jam packed and honestly I've loved every minute of it pretty much. Um, yeah it's definitely had a lot of learning curves. Uh, settling into university, all that sort of stuff, but I honestly have had an amazing experience and I want to thank everyone who's been involved for helping me make that experience so incredible. In terms of what I've been up to today, I uh, actually, as you may be able to tell by the smile on my face, I found out that I was actually successful in my trials for AU Futsal and I'm absolutely buzzing. I literally had a phone call with my parents earlier, I told them the good news. So um, yeah, I'm delighted and I'm really looking forward to the season. And then you may be wondering why I'm wearing a shirt, what the fancy occasion is. We've got our Freshers Ball, so our guests for this year include the likes of Becky Hill and Fuse ODG. It's going to be a really amazing night, looking forward to that, lots of celebrations. But this is going to be the end of the vlog series. If you guys have enjoyed, uh, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any future content. That's all for me today, thanks again for watching and I'll see you all very soon. Thank you.